Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Take a look. Feast your eyes Feast on our eyes. petrifying Palaiosaur. Palaiosaur. A monumentally Monument. magnificent Magnific. marine reptile. Oh, reptile. Well, we wanted to create something really special um, that would excite people about the Jurassic Coast. And um, we wanted to do something very unusual um, that would involve the audience in a sort of interactive way. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dr. <laughs> Davidson. It's basically trying to do two things, which is to educate and to entertain. And we live on this extraordinary coastline called the Jurassic Coast. And uh, it's, it's a beast that actually lived right above our heads 165 million years ago. And so it has a relevance to its place as well. So, join us on a tour of an ancient, ancient oceanic predator. <laughs> Feel free to join in with that one if you want to. It's, uh, it's entirely up to you. Sometimes. It's kind of a, a little bit like a medicine show. Oh, great, there's one. Yeah. Medicine shows are sort of designed to, be, to, to entertain an audience, but on top of that, it is really uh, informing. So instead of having legs, Horace here has got flippers to propel him through the ocean. Well, I play the part of Joe, who's um, Horace's groom. So Joe is the most attached to Horace. Oh, I need your help. After and three, sees Horace as her Horace. pet and looks after Horace and, and really loves Horace. And, and actually, I do really love Horace. And it's my job, Joe, to look after Horace. So I get him ready for you in the morning. I brush his teeth and I polish his flippers. It's aimed at children and adults, so young families, really. That's awesome! Here we've got a palacioosaur. <laughs> Oh, he's got a very long neck, hasn't he? We harness the fascination that children have in dinosaurs and all things Jurassic. Oh, one for you, because you want to do it. There you are. This is a wobbly tooth. Okay, let's have a look. They love brushing the teeth, they love the eyeball, they like things that are gory. Pretty scary, isn't it? No, it's cute. They like polishing the flippers. OK, are you ready? I say pliosaur, big jaw. Ichthyosaur, rings. Plasiosaur, long neck. Oh, wonderful! Round of applause! Lovely. Now look at these eyes here. Now, I grant you they are slightly over theatrically big. Dr Davidson organises crowds to come in. He's sort of in charge of Horace. I think we'd like to step inside. Yes. There's two things going on. There's an outside tour. And then behind that, there's, a, there's an inside tour of the Pliosaur, which is an interactive film. My name is Professor Humphreyson, and I am the world's leading expert on paleointestinal digestivology. <laughs> anyway, while we wait, let me tell you a little bit more about Pliosaurs. Pliosaur or C. rex, as my very good friend Professor Butterworth calls it most amusing, I always find. A truly monstrous appetite. <coughs> now, the world. There was a brilliant animation telling us about all the things that the Plasio ate. Here is its, its eyeball. <laughs> and how they evolved. And it was basically quite disgusting, really. Why? Well, because it ate quite a lot of things and he didn't really, you know, clean up. <laughs> in the end, he had to um, get away really quickly because of all the acid inside the monster's stomach. There's only one thing for it. How did he get out? Well, um... You know... What? The, the pliosaur's rear end. He got out the backside. <laughs> Oh. Daddy! That's amazing. Why is it amazing? It's just how it works and everything like that. But they're really excited about it and they've seen something new and different and excited about exploring the Jurassic Coast. And I think people come away with, uh, with that sort of knowledge of something they didn't know beforehand, which was, you know, that a pliosaur existed. Did you think it was scary in there? Um, no, I thought it was really exciting. And although it's built on a caravan chassis, uh, you can go inside it. Um, it was a little bit creepy and a little bit, it was also quite cool though. Let's roar! <laughs>